A major breakthrough in a murder investigation that spans nearly two decades. An arrest has been made in the case of Rebecca Gould, who was killed back in 2004. Gould was killed just outside of Melbourne. But her suspected murderer was arrested states away in Oregon. Our Katrin Asaf is live in Izzard County with the latest on this developing case. Katrin, what do you have for us? Well, Gould was just 22 years old when her body was found off of Highway 9 just outside of city limits. Now, 16 years later, an arrest has finally been made in her case, with 44-year-old William Alama Miller being taken into custody Saturday night. The Izzard County Sheriff's Office says Miller was residing in Texas in the early 2000s and was visiting Izzard County when the murder occurred. For the past few years, he's been living in the Philippines and just recently returned to the United States. Law enforcement says Miller became a suspect a few months ago. A special agent with the Arkansas State Police tracked him to the Pacific Northwest after hearing he would be visiting the area. Sheriff Jack Yancey of the Izzard County Sheriff's Office says deputies never stop searching for answers in this case and the arrest comes as a welcome breakthrough after years of investigation. This has been something that has plagued everybody here for a long period of time. You know, if you're in law enforcement and you, and you know, these things get to be personal, these kinds of cases, you, you want them to come to, to fruition. It was never cold to anybody that was in law enforcement. We, we, we never quit. There was somebody working it all the time. Miller is being charged with first-degree murder. He will remain in Lane County Jail in Eugene, Oregon, awaiting an extradition hearing. It's still unclear what led police to initially suspect Miller or what his connection to the victim is. Now, this is still an ongoing investigation. Both the Izzard County Sheriff's Office and the Arkansas State Police are still waiting for that extradition order in order to charge Miller with first-degree murder in the state of Arkansas. We'll continue to keep you updated on this case, and we're going to have more coming up tonight. Reporting in Melbourne, I'm Katrin Asaf. Back to you.